A diagnosis of prostate cancer is never easy to deal with. I've come to Cambridge University Hospital to meet Dr Vincent Nanaprakasam to find out how best to cope. Well, Vincent, what advice do you have? Certainly hearing you've got cancer is devastating news for yourself and for your family. But I do tell my patients there's every reason to be optimistic. Many men will live with their cancers and a cure is eminently possible in many cases. But for those who are struggling to cope, there are support services in your own hospital uh, or in your GP's practice or indeed nationally which they should go to. Now as a result of treatment for prostate cancer, I understand that there can be some urinary symptoms. Different treatments for prostate cancer can cause trouble with urinary symptoms. With surgery you might get incontinence or leakage of urine. With radiotherapy you may get uh, irritability of the bladder, making someone want to pee more often. And those kind of things can be managed with treatments and medication. The key thing is to seek help early when that happens. And what about other physical issues that may come up for some people? A lot depends on the kind of treatment. Radiotherapy, for example, may cause bowel symptoms and diarrhoea transiently. Uh, and men who get hormone therapy may find that they're very tired. They may put on weight and, lo and lose their vitality. And understandably, one of the things that most people want to know about is how prostate cancer affects their sex life. Unfortunately, the prostate, being where it is, has the nerves for erections wrapped around it. And there is no doubt that treatments will cause problems with erectile failure or dysfunction. But there is things that can be done to help with this. Um, medication, for example, um, artificial devices, uh, and all these things are available uh, for men who need it after treatment. So can men have children after treatment? So if you have surgery, the tubes as they were will be disconnected. However, you can still retrieve sperm uh, for fertility if that was necessary. In radiotherapy, in general, that doesn't affect fertility. The hormone therapy can suppress that for some time. Coping with prostate cancer isn't easy, but it's good to hear that if you are having any problems, there is lots of help available. For more information, visit the Cancer Research UK website or see the other videos in this series.